Selecting tuxedos or a suit. Many couples will say, we want suits instead of tuxedos, but yet don't know the difference between them. Back in the day, the tuxedos would have tails, a big satin stripe down the pant, and satin on the lapels. Today you will find little or no satin at all on tuxedos. With a suit, you normally don't wear a vest, and wedding parties love to wear color matching vests. Many tuxedo stores will have an extra charge wearing a vest with a suit. With the wedding planner's e-tux, there is no extra fee. From there, you will look at the fit of the tuxedos. Some are modern, traditional fit, and most newer tuxedos are slim fit. Your next decision is what color tuxedo to wear. Black is the most common, then grays, blues, browns, ivory, and white. Then you will decide on tie options. Bow tie versus Windsor long tie. Bow ties have dominated the formal wear business for decades. Now in the last 10 years, all you see are Windsor ties. But if you watch the Academy Awards and any award show, all you see are bow ties. Bow ties are coming back. Now you will need to decide the tie and vest color of the groom. One of the worst questions to be heard at a wedding is, who's the groom? So many times the groom wants to wear the color of the wedding party. Sometimes the only difference could be the color of a boutonniere. This is not a good choice for him. He should color match what the bride is wearing. His vest and tie should coordinate with her color, be it white, ivory or champagne. Your other option is have him wear the matching vest of the tuxedo and wear a white tie. If the groom wants to wear the matching vest, then we suggest no one else wears it so he stands out. Like the bride, none of her attendants will be brighter color than her and same goes true for the groom. Jim's formal wear has lots of color options to match the latest color in bridesmaids dresses. Some dresses are so hard to match the color. Remember this is not another color accessory that would be worn by the bridesmaid it is worn by someone standing next to her. Don't get all wrapped up if you can't find the exact match. It will be obvious that the couple in the selected color belong together. Ushers will normally wear the same color of the groomsmen. One good look is to mix up the ties. If the wedding party is wearing Windsor ties, the ushers could wear bow ties or vice versa. The ring bearer can match the color of the wedding party or the groom, depending upon the relationship of the child to the groom. The junior groom always matches the groom. Fathers always look good in matching vests for black or gray tuxedos. If the groom is wearing a matching vest, then no one else should. Fathers should go to a darker charcoal color, again making the groom in a lighter color than the rest. It is amazing to see grandfathers in formal wear, and with all the extra attention they get, they will have as much fun as if it was their own wedding. For accessories, they should match what the fathers are wearing.